it going everybody? I'm Graham Boyd, Xbox Live's AC Bongos, and I'm here with Glenn Schofield and Michael Condry, the founders of Sledgehammer Games, and we're going to talk about Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Gents, you kicked off Gamescom in style, taking the wraps off multiplayer for Advanced Warfare. How did that feel for you? It felt great, obviously, right? Um, you know, we've been working on the game for three years, and, uh, you know, finally to be able to show people what we've been doing with multiplayer is fantastic. It's, it's like a big weight is off our shoulders. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we call this a labor of love, and it really has been. Everybody that's been working on this, yep. working on the game for Advanced Warfare, finally get to share multiplayer. It's such a great opportunity to be here with fans. It's yep. the perfect place to do it. You've used the phrase game changer a lot when you talk about Advanced Warfare multiplayer. How are you actually changing the game here? So everything from new movements, transformational, to new perks, new abilities, the virtual lobby, man, you name it, this is... This is a new Call of Duty. Tell us about some of the abilities that you particularly like the most. Well, for me, I seem to always be getting shot at a lot, so uh, I don't mind the uh, the Exo Shield. I, I actually really like the Exo Shield. There's seven different Exo yep. abilities, everything from hover to cloak to shield to the trophy system, which is great for objective-based play, like you're running in to grab, grab a dom point. That's so, another one I like. Yeah, yeah so it's a... Uh, it's a ton of fun, and with Pick 13 and all that customization, you really get to craft it for your play style and the mode you're playing. So it feels like even experienced Call of Duty players are really going to have to think about how they approach the game, right? That was one of our goals, you know. They were, the fans were telling us, you know, it's time to shake things up a bit. And so in order to shake things up, you know, they're going to have to learn some of the new moves. But uh, we found that people really seem to love it. Tell me about that fan feedback. You know, what have you been hearing from the community and what things have you put in place to respond to that? Well, look, we've had three years, as Glenn mentioned, on development on this. It's given us a lot of time to really engage with the best fans out there, right? A hundred million players have played Call of Duty. That's a lot of feedback to get, which has been great. So yeah. everything from ways to play, customization, new game modes, as you saw, we brought back Capture the Flag and Hardpoint, new additions like Uplink, to you know, the flexibility of pick 10 and now with pick 13, yep. you know, our ability to really just drive to a, the most unprecedented customization that you've ever seen in Call of Duty. You're adding a ton of customization and personalization to Absolutely. the game as well. Oh yeah, yeah. Tell me more about that. Between pick 13, all the customization there, co-op score streaks and customized score streaks, our loot system with supply system, drops. Yep. Look, there is more ways to customize to your playstyle than ever before. And your weapons and yeah. Yeah, let's talk weapons. So you've brought yeah. in some new weapon types, yeah. but you're also yeah. allowing players to customize them in ways far beyond anything before, right? Yeah, we added the directed energy weapons, which uh, um, you know, it's something that one of the things that we pride on with the game is is a lot of research. And uh, you know, these aren't science fiction; they're science, right? We we see them out there, so we brought them into uh, into multiplayer as well as single player, as well as for the first time, a real heavy weapon we call the XMG. This is going to make you the most badass on the field. You're super slow and your reload takes forever, but you have never put this much lead downfield at once. And it feels like you're giving something back with the Day Zero edition, right? Tell me about that. Where did that idea come from? People are always asking us, can I get the game early? Well, now you can. Yeah, getting the game early is the thing, right? And double XP on Day Zero as well. XP, yeah. Wow, okay. And one of my favorite announces uh, from the Xbox briefing this week was the unveil of the Advanced Warfare custom console. Yes. Right? Yep. What do yep. you guys think of that? It looks amazing. We worked with the uh, the Xbox team to design it, and um, they would come up with ideas, we would come up with ideas, and uh, we're really proud of the outcome. No doubt. Great to hear. Gents, yeah. thank you so much for your time. Great to see Advanced Warfare multiplayer. I'm going to try and get some more time playing it as well. Thank Everybody, you. stay tuned for even more from Gamescom. Don't miss it.